Hello, my friends, and welcome back to a plan let's play of Shadow Hearts Covenant. Or Shadow Hearts 2 for the PS2. My name is Little Bird. This is Story Base Gaming Channel, and today, my friends, we're going to uh, try to figure out what exactly is going on here. Because, uh, yeah, that was, um, that was a pretty freaky uh, way uh, for the last part to end there. Just wait and see, I'll be Japan's best venture person this act. Uh, well, the first thing I want to do though is go back in here and check around uh, to see if there is. Looks like there is something. I see a wolf. But I was hoping for. I don't know. Some other secret here? I mean, I'll, I'll take the wolf, of course. I mean, that's definitely a secret, but. Well, maybe I had to go this way some. Nada. Nothing. Zilch. Zapparoni. Okay. Fair enough. Uh, Blanca, are you ready for this fight? <laughs> Hope you're all having a wonderful day today. Stop, wolf. Are you the wolf traveling with Grando these days? Yeah, what of it? Uh, protecting Inagami is the job of the Matsunagas. We don't need your help. Uh, what do I care about your family history? Silence, impudent pup. My claws will teach you a lesson. You asked for it. You think you can beat me? The man shouldn't make idle threats. I won't stand for any more of your insults. Now you'll witness the prowess of the house of Matsunaga. Bring it on. Not, not the way I was expecting this video to begin, but then again, I didn't expect the last video to end the way it did, so. I have Blanca protected from almost all element, I mean almost all elements, but I don't have to protect against any ring issues. Ooh, I don't have to protect against physical down either. Uh, do I have, um, I have shield. Okay, he's putting up barrier, so our best chance is to probably just to hit it. Ooh. I I'm not used to that. I'm not used to that. This is gonna be tricky. Oh, that's a lot of damage. Nice job, Blanca. Uh, I need a heal. Come back. Oh, that's to an unconscious ally. Well, don't you have cure all? Yes, you do. Thought you did. This isn't such a bad fight. Yeah, that's ain't bad at all. I mean, he's not really hitting with anything. Although, now that I say that, he could. No! He surged, but did not use the special ability. Huh. Well, let's finish him off, shall we, Blanca? Good job. Good job, buddy. Good job. Physical defense down three. That would be really good on someone like Yuri, who does normal physical attacks. How could I be so careless? How could I lose focus on the battlefield? That's what you get for bringing personal feelings into the battle. I am mortified. Let me give you my stamp as a symbol of my undying shame. Soul comments powered up. Looks like, is there only one more wolf to be fought? Or was there another page? I disgraced my family name. Ah, it's okay, buddy. You, di you, you didn't disgrace anyone. You fought with honor. You fought with honor, and there's nothing wrong in an honorable combat. Oh, 
Okay, let's go ahead and, uh, you know, I, I have so many tents. I don't really care about wasting one there. It's no big deal to me at all. Just go ahead and use them. This used to be so stingy with those kind of things. Let's go ahead and run around the perimeter. I am very shocked at the lack of uh, hidden items here. Oh, there we go. Got a star card. Hey, what do you know? Running around? Paid off. Uh, what does the star card do, Lucia? Uh, the woman pouring water into a lake under a starry sky signifies new hope. Reverse signifies a loss of hope. Max HP and battle is increased by 50%. Once again, a really, really, really cool card to use if we could guarantee ourselves using it. The problem is, there's no guarantee that it will happen. Oh, they should have hit something right here. I mean, that's a, that's a, there we go. go. Oh, lottery ticket. I'm not sure if she's upstairs or in this room. We'll, we'll search around, don't worry. I don't see anything here. Time to go up the steps. I'm really loving Shadow Hearts, by the way. This, this, this is just such a, such an enjoyable game. Ah, I need to re-equip Blanca. Oh well. Hopefully, we'll not get sucked well, into another boss fight. How are you feeling now? Much better, thank you. I'm very sorry to have caused all of you so much trouble. No trouble. Thank you for saving me. We should thank you. You told us where Nikolai is. Huh? <laughs> is there something on my face? Yes. Your nose and your eyes. <laughs> That's a pretty silly joke, hmm? Yes, she's always saying stuff like that. Now don't get so angry. You look so much like your father, that's all I'm saying. My father? Yes. <sighs> Did you know him? Yes. You really knew him? Yes. But how? I am his sister. Sister? Sister? What? Huh? Our aunt? So you're Yuri's aunt? His aunt? His aunt? I heard about you from Karanda, but when I first saw you, I thought my brother had come back to life <laughs> as a street urchin. Street urchin? I really want to hear all about you, but I'm afraid we don't have the time. Yeah. Man, there's just so many... Things that this game is expanding on. Seems like, you know, fate is just tying everything together, too. There's a long lineage of guardians of the land of Nippon. The Hyugas and the Inagamis come from that line. For 2,000 years, this has been the base of monks and soothsayers, working to protect humans from evil spirits. Each family has its own unique powers. The power of transforming that you share with Karando is just one of them. So my soul fusion ability, you're saying I got it from my father? Sort of, although your case is a little unusual. Normally the number of forms you can embody is limited to one. Really? I think your unique experiences have taught you how to transform into various forms. They say dormant powers can be awakened through encounters with death or severe emotional disturbances. Oh, we've had plenty of those. You don't say. So I might have more dormant powers? No doubt you have. You and Kwando both. Me too. Yes. Haha, <laughs> so the two of us are still just novices, huh? I guess so. 
Uh, sorry to interrupt, but this is no time to be dreaming about all of that. We can't let Nikolai get away. That's right. Even as we speak, the monster is deep in Mount Fuji, gathering its strength. Uh, in Mount Fuji? Yes, Japan's largest active volcano. Said since ages past to harbor the power of immortality. Uh, maybe Astra is planning to make Mount Fuji adapt. I guess that he is. With that monster's power and the energy in Fuji's ley lines, it wouldn't just be a normal eruption either. If that happened... I completely wipe out Japan! Oh, the dots. Yuri. You're going? Of course we are. Thank you, Aunt Saki. There's lots to talk about when you get back. Sure. Karen. Uh, yes? We've got a lot to talk about, too. Huh? Sure, I I'm really looking forward to it. Why do you want to talk to Karen? Like, I mean, you want to know about the girl that we're hanging out with, I guess, but... Why specifically Karen? Uh, be careful. Is she tied into this somehow, some way? I mean, fate does have a way of interweaving us all together, it seems like. Let me go back up here. Because we came out of the room downstairs, so... Definitely want to explore this room some more. Well, I guess I gotta put on with the chores inside again. Phew, maybe I'll just take it easy today. It's half expecting you to be a lot of member, to be honest. With the way you just are standing there like that. Maybe this guy is. Oh, hello. Seal of Aura? Really need to, need to start using our seals, you know that? What's about to break out on the continent, right? A war's about to break out on the continent. I heard our leader's brother was a soldier. Well, there's a door there, but we can't use it. And a lot of people. What, what, did, was there a lot of person in this village? Did we find one? That makes me think that, uh, we missed something somewhere, somehow, some way. Wouldn't be a surprise, but... You're going off again, are you? Take care of yourself, I'll be praying for you every day. Already talked to that person. The immortal, the, the immortal mountain is a frightening place. You have to take your time getting ready. A terrifying evil just appeared in the fountain of Sakune. Or... Skune? Skune? It could destroy the world. What, you're going to fight it? Yep, that's exactly what we're going to do as soon as I learn how to pronounce it. You have to dry the things you harvest in the summer so like this. Then you'll have things to eat all winter. I mean, there's got to be a lot of person here somewhere, right? What do you know? You're off already. It's tough working for the big wigs, eh? Your mother will be sad to see you go. Maybe the lotto person was our aunt. I just realized that. We didn't go back to talk to her, did we? We did not go back to talk to her. Why did we not? Why didn't we? What in my mind made me think that we shouldn't go back and talk to her? Hold on. I'm sorry, y'all. I need to go fix that. Hey, Otsaki. Be careful. Oh, really? Well, and I don't think that was a door. I think that's a cabinet or a dresser. Because there's another one of those, like, door-like objects in the back there, and that's not a door. I'm surprised there's no lotto person in this village. Hmm. Yeah? Apparently not. Because I just went around and talked to everyone. 
That is strange. Okay, we're, um, uh, no, no, we're not heading to the Imperial Mountain just yet. We're gonna go to Japan, and we are going to Paris, and we're going to Montmartre. And we're checking in on... Uh, where are the wolves? I hear a wolf that was once called the strongest has been meddling in a holy mountain in Japan these past few years. Alright, well it looks like we now know where uh, the last wolf is. Uh, I'm not going to actually change anything from Blanca. Because I'll just leave him the way he is. Because I know he's ready to uh, fight the wolf when we find him. Uh, we'll head to the mortal mountain uh, right now. And I haven't really changed my party just yet. Uh, so we're still going to move with the same configuration. I think I may put Lucia into the lineup. The problem is, I really want to put Lucia instead of Anastasia, but I want all the pictures. I know that sounds, like, weird. I mean, there's no trophy for getting every picture. I just want to get every picture. You know what I mean? Is there anyone else like that out there? Where you feel like you have to take Anastasia into your party? Just for picture purposes? And don't forget, we still have the treasure. What was the treasure? It was um, a pond, a rock, and a garden. I really don't think we're going to find a garden here. I mean, we might. I I'm just saying. I would be really surprised if we did. What's this glowing thing? Uh, it looks like some kind of altar. Okay. We have 274 souls, by the way. And we can, um... Didn't we get a soul drop? Items. We do have a soul drop. Uh, so... You know, that's something that we can look forward to, too. Although, in reality, using the soul drop now is not going to be... It's not going to be too important because we're not going to be able to power up the, uh, the fusion. What are we fighting today? Blooming Phoenix? With... It looks more like a harpy, though. Weird design. It's got one foot, no hands, and wings. A samurai ghoul? A lava lump? Okay. That is very disturbing. Are, are those... Are those skulls? On a bed of lava? Eesh. It's a lot more freaky than I thought it would be when I just saw the name. I'm looking at the name, I'm like, oh, that's a weird looking guy. And then I actually looked at it closer. Disturbing. Okay, what are you going to cleave into? We need to cleave something that there's two of. So the Blooming Phoenix, Blooming Phoenix will be the uh, target. And we need to get Anastasia. So I, unfortunately, I'm just going to have you combo up with Karen. Yeah, I know that breaks the combo. Uh, we're going to snapshot... Uh, who do we want to kill first? Probably this thing. This thing's the most disturbing looking. Always kill the most disturbing looking things first. Okay, it still survived at nine hit points. Are you kidding me? Nine hit points? It's a weird enemy design. Oh, that was cool. The way it cut with the sword? That was neat. Alright, uh, let's take out the... Uh... This thing seems to be really fast. We'll go after this guy first. Alright, now we have to wait for Anastasia. So, just go ahead and defend. Just defend. We gotta kill this thing before next turn. That is definitely for sure. How much HP does he have, Anastasia? Now look this way. Uh, 
321. It's actually quite a lot, but I'm not worried. And the reason I'm not worried is because Yuri's turn will come before his, even though we missed that shot. Ooh, that one hurts. Come on, Yuri. Okay, good. Because with that powered up ability, he could have really hurt. Is it over already? Just saying, he could have really hurt. Blanca with a level up. Yay, Blanca! I wonder if the level cap is 50. Considering that was a cap for the um uh for the apes. And if the level cap is 50, we're getting there pretty quickly. Uh, I need to do something with my party here, though. Lucia needs to be in more parties. Um, Blanca got 42. Karen's at 41 as well. Um, Anastasia's in multiple parties, but I need her to be in multiple parties to make sure pictures are taken. So, I'll bounce between Moose and KJ here. Uh, the reason I'm going back is because left is always right. So I want to explore left first. And sure enough, we got a red crystal. Red crystal, where you at? Red crystal. Crystal containing the heat of the sacred immortal mountain's magma. When offered at the shrine within the mountain, unseen paths are revealed. But do we offer it to the green statue or do we offer it to the red statue? Well? Look, there's a van the passion here. Do you think they should try putting this crystal in it? Put the crystal in here? Sure, why not? Can't hurt. Yikes, what the heck happened? We got transported! Uh, I guess that must have been a warping device. A warping device, huh? I never imagined there'd be a device that like that inside the immortal mountain. Anyway, whatever. Let's keep going. Okay, is this going to lead us deeper in though? Because there was another direction I want to go. Hmm. I'm having doubts. I'm having doubts on which way to go. Because I see another save point there. Alright, looks like we had the same party as before. So why don't we go ahead and combo up on Lucia. And Lucia, uh, evil summoning, can get two this way. Uh, Anastasia, just go ahead and finish him off with a single attack. I know that's a little bit boring, but he only has like nine HP. And can you kill this thing? I don't know why we didn't get uh, Geppetto involved in this combo, but oh well. Oh, because the other guy was moving before Geppetto. All right, well, just hit this thing as hard as you can. Oh, you came so close. Oh, so close. Good try, Kondo. Like seriously, good try, buddy. Geppetto with the kill still here. That wasn't a bad fight. That wasn't a bad fight at all. Okay, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go back. And the reason we're gonna go back is so that I can explore the right path. And I also wanna see if we can take this out. We can. Interesting. Very, very interesting. Any new enemies? No, okay. Uh, same plan as before? I mean, why not? It worked, right? I should have had, uh, Kondo transform now. 
But as long as he goes last, it's not gonna hurt. So we'll just make sure of that. Got them both. Uh, who are you going to go after? Probably the Bloomy Phoenix. Hail Crash. And a both? Sure, why not? I was nowhere close to the vet on that one. Yeesh. Still did a ton of damage, though. Oh! Lightless! He had 38 hit points! Geppetto with another kill steal. Hey, uh, kind of just wanted to make the kid feel happy. That's all. Yeah, sure, why not? <laughs> yeah, that, that's how I'm gonna defend that. Uh, time to go to Team Doodle here. Aha! The chest here. Ooh, a Semigena Crest. You see, this is why I wanted to... This is why I wanted to, uh, go this way. I didn't know there was a crest here. I'm just saying I wanted to go this way to make sure there was nothing else here. Uh, Semigena, where you at? Right there. Um, unfortunately, we still need one more. Of course. One more. Darn it! Would have been really nice. We could have powered up seven press right now. Okay, yes, we should definitely put the red crystal in here because there's nowhere else to put it. It's just strange how there's a save point already right here. Maybe it's because it's going to another area. So maybe through that other path, there's a boss or something. Oh, hello. Okay, that is something I don't have a picture of, but unfortunately we do not have Anastasia in this party. So with that said, we're not gonna be able to do anything with it. So that does mean I need to be on lookout. Did I just got a three person, I just got a three person combo from uh, doing that because of how close uh, Geppetto was to us. That was pretty nice. This guy probably has a ton of HP. Uh, Blanca, you wanna go after it? Wow, 438 damage was about 60% of the uh, guy's HP. Yeah, that thing is pretty strong. Pretty strong, okay, um. Uh, Aircast? Excellent. Okay, we got rid of the giant scorpion. Oh, that was unexpected. It did too much though, it was just unexpected. Uh, let's swap a random tarot card. You never know what you're gonna get and that's part of the fun of playing with Lucia. Current hell of cash increased by two X? Wow! That's awesome! That was amazing! That is incredible! That was not incredible, but I'm still stunned. That was incredible. That is amazing. It's too bad we just spent a bunch of money getting new weapons and armor, but at the same time, I mean, what is that? Probably like 150,000 gold that we just got on one draw. Uh, why don't you cure? Wow, how do I miss a bar that big? 
Oh boy. I mean, we've had some really bad weather in the area lately, so I've had a massive headache for like a couple days now, but that's not excusing how I can miss a bar that big. That is just lazy. So that doubled all our cash or just the cash? Nope, it doubled all our cash. Look, we have 452,000 gold right now. Holy cow. Okay, money is never an issue again. Providing we don't get another one of those cards and it halves all our money. That would be depressing. Um, but yeah, money is never an issue anymore. Uh, let's see. Got a blue crystal. Go ahead and take a look at that. I, I like to look at these things. You know, someone took the time to put it into the game, so I kind of like to take the time to look at them. A crystal contained the cold of the ice that seals the immortal's mountain vent. Now, often at the shrine, the mountain unseen paths are lifted or lighted or revealed. So let's put the blue crystal in. And since we're here, and since we just got a ton of money. Holy cow. We just got a lot of money. Uh, let's go ahead and drop a tent. And fire off a save. Oh boy. Alright. Is this a ring soul? The way the screen goes dark. Ah, it is. Ah, Ring Soul, I haven't seen you in ages. Are you gonna impersonate your wife? Sorry to keep you waiting. So today, I shall assume the role of Miyabi playing the Ring Soul. I'm so nervous. Huh? My name is Ring Soul. I'm the will of the Judgment Ringling, the administrator of Deadly Willy Fate. Uh, surely she doesn't really speak like that, does she? You can't hide from little Missy. I can see your future. Here, my present to you, and a kiss! Uh, the thanks? It's the power of the judgment ring. Yippee! Ha ha ha! Next time I see you, little cutie, I'll give you some more power. I'm gonna watch and make sure every one of you cuties is nice to Mr. Destiny. I had such a great time today. You're my best friends! Uh, the thank you, cutie pie. Ah, uh, that's kind of the thing. That was my Miyabi. She talks real cute, huh? Uh, right? Uh, yeah, sure. Haha, <laughs> 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 phew, I've been practicing that for ages. Every evening, I haven't done anything else. Oh, I'm so pleased you like it. Maybe next time I could do my daughter, Aya. Oh no, don't worry. No, no, no. <laughs> no, I don't mind, really. Yeah, it'd be fun. Uh, okay. Okay then, better get practicing. I'll see you. What kind of woman is she? <laughs> I just love these story elements we get with the, the ring soul. This is so good. All right, who's the attack boost going to? All right, you already have five. Um, You could probably use one. Yeah, your rings get really messy there. Could I uh do something to buff this one out a little bit? No, not really. Kind of don't want to go to Gamble Ring with him. Because I don't seem to really have a problem hitting his specials. And I want his specials to hit hard. Uh, ring customization, though. This is something I want to do. Uh, we haven't done this in a while. Uh, I want to put... Uh, physical defense down three. You have SP defense down. Instant death one. Problem is she really attacks, so it doesn't really bother me. Seal one. Um. Maybe seal three. Petrify one. 
I'll try two. Instant death two. I'm gonna try to have you poison. Because when you get a wolf fight, I think that could probably be more useful. Uh, delay two. That sounds good. A speed of fend down two. Um, how about attack down? Sure. Awesome. I really love the ring soul. The ring soul is so cool. That is such a... I mean, the thing about all the little things this game does, it, it's... it's to, to, to think, hey, let's, let's have a story involving how you get ring power-ups. I mean, whoever thought of that is a genius. An absolute genius. It, it, it's just incredible the way they were able to think of these things. Uh, we want to combo with Lucia. And she's going to be taking a shot of Scorpulus because it seems like the last enemy. Unless there's another enemy you haven't seen yet. You are going to hit something really, really hard. I kind of want to go after the Blooming. Because I'd much rather go for a kill than damage. And for you, if you can take out the Lava Lump... Perfect. Excellent. Uh, now we'll combo up with Tsukiyomi. Our shield... Eh, it's a little bit annoying. Uh, how about you join the combo? And... Um, I guess just hit it really hard. Okay, who's next? Geppetto or Anastasia? Uh, it should probably be Geppetto. Because you have Bright Banish. And then Anastasia will use Hail Crash. The problem is because he has special defense up, these attacks aren't doing as much as we would like them to do. Yeah, if, if I would have hit the red, I we probably could have killed him actually. And if he didn't have the special defense up, he would have died. So we can close. Like, really close. And, again, talk about really close. I want to throw up a tarot card, but he's going to attack. So since he's about to attack, I say we just end it. Good job, team. All right, so I think that's all of our pictures. So we want to use Team Doodle here for a while. Uh, who do we have? Uh, Lucia DePetto need the experience. Karen's actually at 42 now. Um, kind of want to get Yoakim and Karen more experience, though. These two definitely need it. He could need it. Yeah, we'll just stick with it. I'll go ahead and run him with Team Doodle for a while. I could take out Yuri. I mean, that's something I could very easily do. It's just... Yuri's very good at killing things. We don't have any more crystals. What's that? Huge jug. That's a random place to put something. Uh... Okay, so we already have this small jug on Yoakim, right? And lost SP is doubled. What does a huge jug do? Uh, forget. It's the opposite. Loss of is cut in half. Yeah, but it also reduces your stats, I believe. So if we were to go to someone like Ferrando and equip the large jug, yeah, our stats go down. Yeah, that's what I thought. Not my favorite item in the world. It, it really isn't. Uh, since we don't have a need for money. Yeah, let's make sure we had that on All right, fair enough 
We need to find another stone. That's a really weird place to hide an item now. Okay, let's go ahead and form up on Geppetto. Uh, hold on, hold on, hold on. I want you to fusion first. Now let's go to Somnium. Been using it today a lot. Uh, I think you're already... Yeah, you're already lined up. And, uh, Lucia, join the party. All right, Geppetto's starting us off, so Geppetto hit an air cast on uh, the ugly one. Okay, uh, who's next? Blanca? This should kill it. That's such a great ability though. It only costs 20 SP. I mean, uh, 20 MP. So you can use it all day long. You know what I mean? This should take out this guy. And do you want to drop a meteor on this thing? Oh, you can't actually drop a meteor. Uh, what's your, um, I don't know what your class is. So let's just go non-elemental. Perfect, yes. Get this guy out of here. Oh, he survived? Are you kidding me? Oh, come on, game. He should not have survived that. Look how much HP he has. He has, like, nothing left. Oh. I'm disappointed that I didn't kill. I really am. Okay, we're looking for a um, stone here. And I don't see one. What is the point of this back area? Oh, that's right. Oh, wait. Hmm. How do we get... We, we can't take off any of the stones that we have up, or else we'll lose our way to teleport. So what do we do here? I'm unsure. We'll just have to go back and uh, explore. All right, uh, let's see. Take out the Phoenix if you can. It's not a, it's not a good, not happy with that one. Oh, it worked anyway. All right, uh, Somnium up next? Yeah, let, let's get you up next. And then we'll finish with uh, Blanco's Soul Comet here. Got them all teed up for you, buddy. Let's do it. Ah, oh, wow, that's... That was not good. I mean, even if it was perfect, I don't think we would have killed it, but that was just... That was not good at all. Okay. Scorpion's dead. I would be very surprised if it survived this. Sweet! Wow, uh, I think it's even more disgusting close up. Seriously, that is one messed up lump of lava skull thing. Is that a body hanging off the top of it? Got some bonus souls? I would gladly take that every single day of the week.
If I if I can get more souls, that 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 makes me very happy. Okay, the question is I have a theory. And there's only one way to test a theory and that's just a uh, you know, test the theory. Um, if I go back to the first area, since this statue is lit up, well, the teleport system still... Oh, God, this is not good! Oh, this is definitely not good. Now they move faster, too. shouldn't stack, right? Hopefully it doesn't stack. I mean, we could just game over right here because we never, ever, ever get a turn. Hey, we got a turn. How about that? So we, we got to make it count. Yeah, we, we have to make this turn count, absolutely. So what we're gonna do is we're all gonna come on Geppetto. And Geppetto, how are you gonna lead us off? Can't hit more than one. But I definitely want to kill one of these things if I can. I don't know if this is going to do it, but... It's worth a shot. Oh, that did it. Fantastic. Um, what's next? We need to get rid of these birds. I know Somnium can easily get rid of one. Okay, now for you two, Blanca. Not successful. Did we need to do this? No. Is it fun? Definitely. That's what you get for messing with me. Giant meteor. Okay, now we should be able to take on the scorpion here. Uh, let's fuse up with, uh, well not fuse up with, but come up with Geppetto. Looks like Somnium's gonna go first. Blanca? Blanca? Go get him. I don't think this will kill. No. 350 damage is a lot to ask. Ooh, close. Uh, I don't think you need to use any other magic, though. You can just probably walk up to him and have Cordelia punch him. Wow, Cordelia can punt. <laughs> <laughs> Did you see that guy bounce? Oh, that was great. Good job, Cordelia. Okay, we definitely need to heal after that one. That was a mess. That was an absolute mess. Uh, Kwanda has a warning bracelet, right? Warning device. If, if I'm going to be using this party uh, to work on these two... I might as well give it to uh, Lucia. Can't. I can give it to Blanca. 
And and I just know that hey, if we find a wolf, you know, go back and and uh, redo that. I don't have any more crystals. Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm kind of stumped on uh, how this works. I really should have drawn a map. But I really didn't think that I would need to draw a map. Hmm. So let's go back to the south to see what's the south. And then we'll figure out where all the stones are. Lucia, join up. And Geppetto, you're first, so... Try to kill... Well, try to kill. I mean, Cordelia's got a lot of strength in that Tanuki outfit. That's the problem with Geppetto. All of his, all of his specials are just attacks. And his attacks are nice, but at the end of the day, they're still just, you know, attacks. Oh, that's not good. That is not good. Yeah, all of that could have been avoided. And now we have one of these charging, and I'm not sure which one charged up. I'm gonna go after this one because he's next in order. And then Blanca, try to take out the other one. Okay, okay, okay. Um, throw a tail. I'll act I'll like action speed? Oh, that's cool. Boom, boom. Nice card timing there, Lucia. I'm telling you, Lucia's really good. It's just hard for me to find a spot for her. Okay, so if we take this out, it goes away. So we definitely need this in here. And then, there's a blank spot up here. But there should be a, um, a spot where we have a stone in. So we need to go back to that area and pick up the stone. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, keep it just like it is. Rather than form a three person combo, because what I do is it basically cheats this, cheats the system and allows a Geppetto to go at a spot he normally wouldn't be able to go at. Because Geppetto was moving after everyone else moved, but because we got him a part of our combo, uh, he was able to basically jump in line. Or jump the line. Looks like something died there. Oh, two things died. Fantastic. Oh, that's... Oh, that's a shame. You know, I always like to say the first attack is the most important attack. Oh, still got him. Ooh. I thought he had like 360 hit points and he survived by 1 HP. And I would have been like, oh, come on. Not only did we miss, but he survived by 1 HP. You gotta be kidding me. But no, it didn't happen. So we're all good. Uh, is that treasure chest? No. Okay, so where... So for some reason, I, I went right past the, the first shrine. Yeah, somehow I went right past the first shrine to the right, and I went to the second shrine. So, that was the issue. Uh, so at least we know where we're going, but unfortunately we're gonna have to go there in the next episode because... Uh, I mean, we're, we're getting light here, 
Uh, and we still have a lot to explore. So if we don't stop here, we're going to be going over like an hour and 10 minutes. And uh, th there's always next time, my friends. It, it, it's, it's so nice to be able to play a game and be like, okay, I have to force myself to stop. Because then that makes me more excited when I come back and play it again. Because I'm, 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 I just want to play the game again. So tomorrow when I play this game again, I'll be like, yes, get to play Shadow Hearts again, and it's gonna be fun. Uh, I'll see you then, my friends. Until then, yep. Until then, I say that three times in a row. I'm excited! I'm excited! So long, and take care. Thank you for watching this video. Feel free to comment on what you saw and what you would like to see next. I always love to hear your thoughts. Please be sure to like and subscribe for more. Also, please do not forget, you matter, you are brilliant, and you are loved. And you should always remember to be true to yourself. Don't let the world tell you any different. Much love to you from your friendly feathered flightless bird. Till next time.